Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living and a return worth having. When a person is an audio cast recorder, he's not going to sit in the most famous, busy space. He's also not going to sit in a place that interferes with people's rights. He's also not going to be in a spot that interferes with people's activities. He's going to try and find a quiet spot to be. But we also have people with a lot of special needs. We have the elderly that need to be able to walk in a city. And I can tell you, this city that I've been in is nowhere ready for the elderly. It's nowhere ready for people with disabilities. Every sidewalk practically is cockeyed, which means that a person who's walking with a walker is being strained to try to stay upright along the way, along the walk. We also have these marvelous little Lego dot things that are supposed to be braille for the blind, which is marvelous, but I can tell you there's a better way to handle it. The, sli the, the sliced lines are better for everyone because they don't trip a rollator, they don't trip a walker, they don't trip an elderly person, and they don't monkey a wheel of someone who's in a wheelchair. We have to be willing to be honest about what's going on in the true biological lifetime of an individual, but the person's biology is belonging totally and solely cellularly to the individual. It does not belong to a group of scientists, it doesn't belong to a group of students, it doesn't belong to people who just have a religious bent against something because they don't understand it. God creates all things. We know this as pagans. We can look around the world and see that God creates everything, everyone, every soul, every aspect of it. But we do have birth defects, and birth defects do occur. But sometimes a more like an asshole will go, oh, you can give a birth defect? I'm going to prove that you don't. No, you don't have the fucking right to touch anyone without their permission. And maybe the concept is say, look, the birth defect might be not what you can see. You're trying to prove something that you can see, and the spirit and the soul of a person isn't something you can always see, if you know what I mean. It's not something you can hack. It's not something you can take. It's not something you can move. It's not something you can shake. And what I'm saying to these fucking religious right people is get the fuck off people's rights. You are trying to interfere with women having babies or not. Not your fucking decision, because you're not the spouse. You're not the provider. You're not the financial aspect of that activity. You see, it's not just bringing a child into the world. It's being mature enough intellectually, psychologically, emotionally, spiritually, and educationally to rear a child into our society that doesn't fuck our lives.